this video covers the Alex topic introduction to solving an equation with parentheses. So first off, I'm going to give us a general strategy for solving linear equations. So first, we need to simplify each side of the equation as much as possible, right? We want to get rid of all grouping symbols such as parentheses, and we need to combine like terms. Step two is we're going to collect all of our variables on one side of the equation. Then we need to collect all of our constant terms on the other side of the equation. Next, we need to make the coefficient on the variable term of equality equal to one, and we can use the multiplication or division property of equality for that. And then we can state our solution. I'm not gonna do it in this video, but I would highly check that you, I would highly suggest that you check your solution, especially on an exam or quiz or when points are worth a little bit more, especially if you have time complete your exam or your quiz, go back and check your answers. You'll be glad to get those points back if you might have made a tiny mistake. So here we have two examples. Our first example is 2 times 4w minus 6 equals 36. So I'm going to go ahead and rewrite that actually up here. So I've got a little more room. They all look bigger when I'm putting them on my computer. So 2 times 4w, we have to distribute to get rid of those parentheses, is 8w. 2 times negative 6 is negative 12. That equals 36. I'm then going to go ahead and get all my constants on one side by adding 12 to both sides. What I do to one side, I have to do to the other. So I get 8w equals 48. I then need to go ahead and divide both sides by 8. So 48 divided by 8 is going to give me 6. So W is 6. Final answer. Let's change colors and work through this second example. I have 3 times 3y plus 4 equals 39. So 3 times 3y that gives me 9y. 3 times 4 is 12. That equals 39. I'm going to go ahead and subtract 12 from both sides to get my constants balanced. By balanced, I mean all on one side of the equation. So I've got 9y is 27. We divide both sides by 9 to get the constant uh, to get the coefficient on our y equal to 1, and I find that y equals 3.